Well, you know, tonight for you, a group of college students in Dubuque, they're getting involved in battling the city's housing issues locally. With that in mind, let's go live right now to KWWL Dubuque reporter Max Tedford with more details. Max. Well, Dubuque's Human Rights Commission decided Monday night that they will be partnering with Loris College's civic leaders to help combat Dubuque's housing issues. Now, the Civic Leader Program is just three years old, but since its creation, it's encouraged Loris students to get involved with improving their local community. Loris Civic Leaders have worked with the Human Rights Commission since the student group's creation. The commission chair, Mallory Gardner, a Laura student and member of the Civic Leaders First cohort, is hopeful the partnership will be helpful to the city. Both groups are looking to help the community in very similar ways, so helping each other get that work done, uh, I think will be accepted and, really po and have some really positive feedback from the commissioners. Through the partnership, Laura's civic leaders will be working mostly with the Human Rights Department's Housing and Food Access Subcommittee. Now, the civic leaders will first mostly focus on giving tenant, helping tenants know their rights and helping those in shelters get more resources. Now, live in Dubuque, Max Tedford, News 7, KWWL. Max, thank you very much. Housing, always a key issue in every community.